YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. If you uh, whoever is not subscribed or a reoccurring viewer, uh, click the bell notification. Click the subscribe. I really would appreciate that. I really would appreciate you to like the video, to comment on the video. Let me know how I'm doing on the video. Um, so I can know how to, uh, how I want to address, how I want to address things and, uh, come differently and stuff like that. So if you are not, um, follow me on social media, on social media, I'm either T-R-E-S-O, M-A-C-K, Tresso Mac, also known as Tresso Mac, or I'm Mr. Channel 5, M-R-C-H-A-N-N-E-L-5. Uh, if you're not following me on my Instagram, if you're not following me on Facebook, go change that. I'm going to have all that in the video. I got I got my social media in my other videos too, so you can find me on social media. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to actually get into the topic of taking accountability of the women that we decide to intermingle our lives with. Uh, there's a lot of different movements right now that's uh, making it seem like women are just these bad people. They're, they're these bad entities. They're just looking for money and looking for certain things. And just like with anything else, there's some great women out here. There's some really respectful women. There's some women that we can uh, appreciate and trust and uh, trust wholeheartedly. And they deserve to be helped. And they just had situations that um, was unfortunate, maybe, but it's actually a good woman. And then there's the other side that there's, there's horrible women and they are here to use you. And those type of women that use you and abuse you and don't keep you but lose you, they show nothing but signs from the beginning that the woman was a red flag, the woman was promiscuous, the woman was fast. Same thing, vice versa, the male showed you everything was negative, right? And we keep wanting to ignore these red flags. We want to ignore these red flags real bad. Uh, we want to desperately look away. We want to like act like we didn't see that. Just so we can have a mate, a partner, a companion. Um, even in friendships, sometimes we do it. But right now, I'm speaking about relationship. But um, that's something that I've noticed even within myself. I've dealt with a lower class, lower vibration individual, and I wondered. I sat here and played victim, like, all women is bad, all women is bad, nah. It was simply the ones that I was dealing with because maybe the young lady was easier for me to get uh, based off of my financial status and my mentality at the time, so I accepted her. And over the course of having sex with her and spending time with her, I've caught emotions for her. And um, yeah, she showed every sign of her being a red flag, Instead of seeing that and walking off, I wanted to believe that she wasn't. So I say that to say, we won't be having all these negative experiences about women if we actually go talk to the women that don't show these red flags. Maybe it's because we're too insecure, maybe it's because uh, we don't feel like inadequate, whatever the situation is. But I challenge you to change your mentality about yourself. I challenge you to. Um, change your mentality about women. I challenge you to um, have a more positive outlook on life and um, not view everything as far as being a victim, but maybe take accountability and change those things. I've had a lot of negative experiences with women too, but I've realized that it's not every single woman out here that's this negative individual. It is uh, these women that I keep entertaining, allowing myself to intermingle with. No one's forcing me to deal with these type of red flag individuals. It is uh, my own doing. So I've challenged myself to read books about African American literature and financial management, time management, so I can actually better myself and level up and actually find a more quality woman same attributes that I had and on the same page with me as opposed to be continuously settling for someone under me, lower than me, in whatever way too. I'm not better than nobody. I don't say it to snack like I'm just uh, Mr. you know. But um yeah I have some great attributes that I'm willing to bring forward.
forth, and I always do. And uh, respectfully, I should find a mate, a partner that is into that same thing, same thing with all of us. So the message of this video is let's take accountability for our bad actions and our, our um, obliviousness to all the obvious signs. And I challenge you to go find a better woman, go work with yourself. I challenge you to stop playing victim and look at yourself in the mirror. Um, with those things being said, I will be having more and more content for you. Please comment, subscribe, click the bell notification. Let me know uh, what what I can change about my approach. Let me know, um, you know. Let me know what I can switch up. Let me know what I can switch up. Uh, as far as as far as everything right now. I will be working on content way more consistently. I just had my daughter recently, so I'm a new father. I'm getting used to all of that. But everybody that subscribed, I appreciate you for your subscription. Uh, please go share the video so other people can actually uh, find out about my material. And uh, yeah, I will have all my social medias in this video. Everybody that's commenting on my videos, letting me know that they like my stuff and they like what I have to say. I appreciate you too. I'm putting all this stuff out for y'all. And everybody have a good day. And uh, yeah, that's my challenge for you. Go better yourself. Have a great day.